Let's, uh, let's just do it. Select not a them. care in the world about ah. weaknesses or anything like that. We're just going for it. Do no. It. We just gotta do our best. Oh, look at this oh, butterfly. So Mothman? Morph, Morph Moth? Morph Moth? That's a cool name. Dude, the Morph Moth Prophecies. Dude, that reminds, <laughs> that reminds me of Cumbelina. Cum- oh, Corwin R.I.P. Out. Cum- Corwin Cum- out. Yeah, dude. She was a... Uh, she was a... a beautiful... Uh, beautiful... Our, ba- our beautiful baby girl. She was a Dust Ox in dust Pokemon Ox. Emerald. Yeah. <laughs> we named her Cumbelina. Yeah. She started from a little wormple. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so she and awesome. the string shot, the string shot, that's what we call it, Cumbelina. Yep. Into oh, cool. a, yeah, it makes sense. Into a beautiful, beautiful young woman. And then we lost her. Oh, we did. No. We, we, oh, my God. That's right. What happened? But in, cause since it was a Nuzlocke, you know, mm-hmm. uh, we were, had to, we were supposed to oh, release what? them after they die, because they, like, die, die. Oh, yeah. okay. But uh, ours had too like, many, like, HMs really or something? Yeah, yeah, that's a, yeah, the Nuzlocke. Uh, game format and uh but we loved her so much we couldn't bear to to throw her away oh, that was her yeah okay so i we, remember we tried to like let Duberger go maybe yeah and oh Duberger yeah no couldn't. no no it wasn't Duberger. it was mikor's own mikor's own wanted to keep coming back. yeah he wanted to keep coming back he didn't want to leave us um so, so, we so put, wilson put him in hell but <laughs> um <laughs> but we renamed one of our uh storage boxes that was the sky we renamed it neve <laughs> Just heaven backwards. Just because. So she could be flying in the bay forever. <laughs> we could check on we her. We could check in on her every once in a while. Just I wanted to put fucking her best Mikor's self. own there too, but Wilson was like, no, it's a fucking zombie. He's going to hell. <laughs> yeah, I like, think we just put him in trash. Well, it was <laughs> it was like a desert or some shit. <laughs> the desert, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but now we're going to have to kill the, the Cumbelina fam- familia? familia? It's a corrupted, it's a corrupted combo. <laughs> yeah, the corrupt combo. Robo combo, <laughs> Robo. Come back, come back, Lena, dude. So what would happen? Yes. We're talking about this. What would happen if Mega Man, come back, and Samus Aran, yeah, had a baby, had a baby. First of all, does Mega Man have semen?s He's got Robo he, DNA. He's got robot DNA. I don't think he's got a Winkus though. Bingo! That's, Robo DNA. Well, he doesn't necessarily <laughs> need a Winkus. He just needs a, a delivery format or delivery uh, utensil. He probably just uses his fingers, since that's how he steals other okay, Robo DNA. Okay, and then yeah, but would his Robo DNA combine with the Humo DNA? <laughs> Humo? Probably not. <laughs> and make well, it, Samus is all, her DNA Robo is tainted human. too. She's not full human. She's oh. like a mutant too. How the heck am I so, supposed to get over there? Well, oh, I think I need the because uh, so, that's all that matters is that if the reproductive systems are simpatico, right? Right. If they can work with each other. But in this uh, scenario, so like if, it does it does work? What so do you could, think? So this... could in this universe, yeah, could fucking Megaman, you know, stick his finger or whatever Ouch. in another robot? And merge their DNAs, and that robot become pregnant with their baby. Yes, because Mega happen? Man's main concept is that he borrows from other like reploids or whatever they're called. Yeah, but mm-hmm. like, do can the reploids reploid bang and make babies, or are they, are they always built? Um, I think Mega Man has the feature of like borrowing, like Rogue taking powers yeah. from somebody or siphoning powers but and using. As, like, but I'm talking reploid about producing a baby. Goes, I'd imagine it'd be like, remember that Robin Williams movie, like Robots or whatever? Yeah. It's probably like that, where they just get a kit and build one together. Yeah, that's, that's, what I'm sa- that's what I'm saying. Making one's like, half the fun. And you're just like, ah, oh, well, instructions. And, and you just keep stuff. modulating parts as it grows up? Yep. Okay. So that's just because you have to, because it goes into the whole, would they, one of them end up being pregnant? Like, would the lady be pregnant? Or would Mega Man be like a fucking seahorse dad and be pregnant? Or like, <coughs> I don't think Mega Man would be a seahorse dad. How do you know? Because he doesn't have anywhere to like store them. That's what I'm saying. It's like because neither would the, oh, neither would the lady, right? Unless they were built. I thought is, or made is that, that how seahorses work again? Yeah, I thought yeah. it was like the males the, are like kangaroos. Yeah, the, the, the males pocket. incubate the eggs. Yeah, but like the females give the eggs to the male. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And then the it's like a xenomorph. And then they explode out of the dad's belly. Yeah. Just like a xenomorph. No, it's belly, not a chest. Just like a human. <laughs> Just like a xenomorph. Well, it is kind of like a human because men have all the DNA. Yeah. Women have some of the DNA, but men have most of the genetic in their little spermies. Well, it's a combination, man. I thought it was 
Yeah. Unless my health class lied to me. We, we, we carry the, the, the seed. Yeah, yeah, we carry that that uh, beautiful those beautiful beans. Those beautiful fucking <laughs> tail beans. beans. Beans with little rat tails. Think about those seams. Uh, but the, the genetics are fifty fifty. It's just the we we have the active component, right? Yeah. Um, I'm already at the boss. I am. Not to say that the woman's one is passive necessarily, but. I mean, our dudes go for a swim, right? I think it's the males, though, that dictate the sex. Hmm. Yes. I heard that yes. if you rest your <laughs> And I don't mean, like, we get sex. Uh, no, we get it ice. now. No, I don't well, mean the, like, that it I think, turns uh, into girls, I think but you're if you right. keep it warm, it turns it into, so, males. into boys. Like, uh, There's various like things alligator like that. Eggs. Happy Women's Week. Do you know that we all start as girls? Yes. Yeah, we all That's have That's why we have nippies. Yeah. And then, uh, that's why it makes sense then, because our reproductive organs are like, no, we're not going to stay on the inside. We're going to go on the outside. Yeah, because a vagina is an inverted penis. Because it's all there. It's all there. Yeah. So that's why males have nippies. That's like okay. we used to be ladies. I, I don't. I'm not going to speak with knowledge that I know anything. But like, what if like the dude never know, take anything we say the, on this. The like, bell yeah. end of your penis, you <laughs> yes. know, the tip, the clitoris was like your clitoris. Yes. Yeah. If you have you ever seen enlarged clitori <laughs> that look like little baby dangus? All the time. Yeah. So I look at those all the time on the here. Right? Yeah, all right. This. Uh, yeah. So that's the thing. Frick. We don't have exact. Shane. We don't have exact knowledge. We just have what we think we remember hearing or reading in certain you got suppositions. It. You got it. You got it, buddy. You got it, buddy. <laughs> Suck it. I was one hit. That's what you get dying. for corrupting the memory of Cumbalina. Yeah, rip combo. Dude. You didn't deserve her visage. <laughs> what even is this guy's power again? Being a moth. Stars. He like he put sleeping powder. You know, being a moth know. is kind of a superpower, right? I think it's you suck in like a bunch of garbage and throw it at people. Sounds like Kirby. Yep. Let's talk. You got garbage. Let's I talk, didn't get garbage. Let's talk about Capitillus. Oh, it's it's Silk Shot. Let's try, Looks like let's garbage talk about to me. The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Let's talk about Eric Larson, dude. Eric Carl. Carl. Eric Larson's a comic book guy. Eric Carl's <laughs> the, the cute book guy. Um, <laughs> He's super cute. Yeah. <laughs> he has the but, cutest face. So Capitillus, right? Exactly. Catabella. They either they go they either form a chrysalis or a cocoon, right? If they're the type of caterpillars that make chrysalis, they become. <laughs> I love the putting the eye at the end of things. Yeah. So. <laughs> <Clitori> cluster. <laughs> <laughs> they become butterflies, right? Yep. But if you're a caterpillar that makes cocoons. What if there's a peanut butterfly? You become that would be amazing. You become <laughs> if that would be if their chrysalis looked like a fucking peanut pod, peanut shell, <laughs> a legume. Yeah. Um, oh, we'll get to legumes someday. I'll tell you what. Legume eyes. Uh, <laughs> legume eyes. <laughs> I have legume eyes. Yeah, we do. <laughs> Look at my legume eyes. Um. So, the the crazy part isn't the cane. Stay away. Isn't the the, the capitillars changing, <laughs> simply changing into either the bulberflies or the moths. Yeah. It's the fact that when they're in those, those little pods. Yeah. They get completely like melted down into goop. Mm -hmm. And yeah. it's not like, like their body just changes. They don't, it's not, like, it, their not body metamorphosis. Their body breaks it's... down into like goop yeah. and gets reformed into a fucking butterfly. That's crazy. And then they retain like their memories, quote unquote memories from being a, a caterpillar. Ah. Like all the things that they learned, quote unquote learned, because I mean they're bugs. <laughs> as a as a caterpillar. Are they? <laughs> they they remember as a butterfly. So we're going after the X hunters. All right, we'll be back with this guy in the next episode. And more weird evolutionary this, uh, things. Flamestag! <laughs> Flamestag! Wink, wink!